should pause and say, what do I mean by puzzle? A puzzle is a problem that is fun to solve and has a right answer. Humans usually encounter their first puzzles as infants. How do they get these people to play with them? Or how do they get to their baby food? Can they climb out of their crib or get past the baby gate? Most importantly, they play with puzzles in a traditional sense with blocks and toys. As infants, we are already experiencing a phenomenon called neurogenesis. Unlike neuroplasticity, in which the brain rewires and expands existing neurons to do different functions, neurogenesis is the growth or birth of brand new neurons. As children, these neurons will be associated with things such as recognition of color and control of our motor skills. As adults, neurogenesis creates neurons which regulate stress. Neurogenesis is also used to measure brain training at a cellular level. Brain training is when a person continues to solve puzzles day to day, just as a runner would run laps or a bodybuilder would lift weights. Brain training has positive effects, such as improving a person's memory, attention, concentration, decision-making, and mental flexibility. Tetris is a popular puzzle to brain train with. Studies with an MRI have shown the brain will display less activity for those who play regularly compared to the people who do not. The brain is also physically thicker in comparison. Another interesting aspect about the game is something called Tetris Effect. Tetris Effect is when a person plays so much Tetris, the game begins to leak into dreams and reality. The person will always be thinking about Tetris. Another popular puzzle is the Rubik's Cube. When a person is given a Rubik's Cube, they first try to build one side and get stuck. The Rubik's Cube is actually a very easy puzzle with a set method of solving it. A person who regularly trains in solving a cube can improve dexterity as well as problem-solving skills. You can learn to break down the puzzle into steps, then how to break down other puzzles, and even real-life problems. Puzzles are a very easy way to keep a healthy mind from any age. They can change the way we think, sleep, and react. How about when you get a moment, solve a crossword or a Sudoku puzzle. We look at trying to eat healthy and staying fit, but our brains need some exercise too. Improve your dexterity and memory. I'm sure your brain will thank you.